Hello, and thanks for checking in for another episode of Cars and Caravan. Today I'm inside our tow car, and this is a Mitsubishi L200, and it's the Series 6, and the spec level is Barbarian X. But this particular vlog isn't about the truck in itself. I've done one of those previously when we first picked it up, and I'll pop a link in the description below. So if you want to take a look at that, please do. But this vlog is actually about an optional extra that we had fitted, um, which just, it, it always receives lots of interest. Whenever we go anywhere and we use this optional extra, people ask us about it, they want to see how it works, and uh, are like, oh, wow, that's really clever. And the optional extra I'm talking about is our sliding load bed. Now, if anybody's owned a pickup truck before or are possibly even thinking about um you buying a pickup truck as a, for a tow vehicle or everyday vehicle one of the curses of a pickup truck is the load bed and that is mad because obviously you, you might be buying a pickup truck because it's the load bed that is appeals to you you need the space but it doesn't matter how tall you are or how long your arms are if you fill that load bed to the max and push everything to the back you just can't reach it you can't get it to get it back out of the truck Yes, you can walk round the sides and you can you can get some of that gear from the sides. But you often, we had a Series 5 before this one and we often found ourselves trying to lean in through the side, hooking things um, and it was a nightmare. Or if you had put your shopping in the back and it had rolled <laughs> all across the truck bed, you were just, you had to, I had to send in our daughter, you know, pick her up, chuck her in the load bed and go, go get that tin of beans right at the back there, get that tin of beans. And one of the other things that we did with the Series 5 is we kept the load bed as it was and we actually put a hard cover on it um, so that it kept the profile of a pickup truck. So you only had the depth of the bed, but the, the cover that we, we decided on, the tonner cover, it was hinged um, with the stays on it. So you could actually only lift it to a certain degrees and this restricted any side access even more. So when we came to look for the series six it was like well there must be a solution out there for this there's got to be something out there and when i started searching around the answer was right there it was actually on the mitsubishi website under their accessories page and it wasn't the first place i was i was going to look i was looking at all the different sort of four by four uh truck pages that's, that did accessories but there on the mitsubishi was this sliding load bed so i thought brilliant great speak to the, the dealership about it and they'd never heard of it they actually thought that it was something else i was looking at which was these utility drawers so you put another bed within that within the truck bed and it has utility drawers and then just raises the level and i was like no 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 no, no it's not that one it's a sliding load bed um now the sliding load bed is exactly what it you know what it says on the tin so it it sits within the bed of the, your truck bed and you load all of your cargo onto that bed and when you want to get it or load it you you slide it in and out of your truck to, so you've got full access to everything that you're putting in the back yes it does eat into your load bed depth um, but we on this new series six we've actually gone for a hard top so we've got a nice height on that and uh, yeah, the load bed just sits very nicely in there on runners. It just it just bolts straight into the into the truck bed. Now we did have ours fitted by the dealer, but these are aftermarket parts. And actually, the one that we've got fitted in here is made in Britain, and it's a, a Gear Mate is the name of the company. And like I say, just just bolts straight into the into the bed of the truck. So it has three sliding positions and the first one is just slightly out of the truck bed the second one comes to the same length as the dropped down tail bed so once you drop the back down it comes right out to the end of, of the drop down and then finally it's fully extended and it locks into place just with each time you ratchet it sort of just locks into place and to release it you push the button and slide it back in the bed itself, the me with the sliding low bed, when it's fully retracted and inside the truck, it can hold up to uh, 800 kilos. And when you've got it fully extended out the back of the truck, 
it uh, will hold 400 kilos. We've actually found the bed really versatile. I mean, going to pick up uh, the shopping, so especially now we've done a lot of click and collect in the current pandemic when this when this vlog was filmed, and to be able to just slide the bed right out, pop the crates on the back of the truck and then load them onto the bed and then hand it back has been absolutely fantastic. If you, uh, if you're, you know, depending on how tall you are, it makes a huge difference to being able to access everything because you can pull the bed right out and you can get to the side of it and obviously load from, from the end. Um, it's been brilliant, obviously, for caravanning. When we've loaded it up to the hilt to take everything away in the caravan, we put all, obviously, all the awning and, the, and all the gubbins and the shopping and everything all in the back just to be able to pull that out, leave it there until you want bits from it to unload when you're setting up the caravan. And likewise, when we're packing up to go again, we just, you know, pull the bed right out, pop the bits on it, and then when we're ready to go, button in, push it all the way back into the truck, shut it up, and that's it. Done really, really easy. And we've even used it as a as a picnic table or stand up bar. You know, you just you just pull it out in, and have your food on it. And if you've got your camping chairs with you and that, and obviously you can sit by it. So it's been absolutely fantastic. Really, really the best bit of kit we've brought for our for our Mitsubishi L two hundred. It really is. So yeah, see you seen it in action throughout this vlog and while i'm waffling on but if there's any questions you want to ask about it please just pop them in the comments and i'll be only too happy to to sort of give you any you know any advice or feedback on it that i can but it's a great bit of kit if you're considering a pickup truck and you want that versatility and ease of loading that bed um, without the hassle of reaching in or you know almost fishing for the stuff that's rolled all the way to the back or been pushed to the back it really does maximize your load bed makes it so easy and yeah it you know really really do consider it if you're buying a pickup truck anyway that's all from me and as always until next time cheerio <laughs>